Okay guys, welcome back to my channel. So this is another Divine Masculine reading. So let's go ahead and get started. So the songs that you guys got was Love You Down, Ready for the World, and That Night Boosie. So the numbers that was channeled for you guys was 10, 36, 606, um, 025, 10, and the channel messages that you guys got was age difference, um, asking for money, but ain't ain't smash yet, fucked up the car, pregnancy, and then we have bitches want oh bitches want the feminine position, even the best friend. Okay, so this was the messages that was channeled. So. Yeah, this could be a situation where, like, the feminine was trying to come on to, like, not the feminine. The feminine best friend was trying to come on to the uh, masculine or a whole bunch of other females was trying to come on to the masculine as well. Um, somebody definitely had crashed a car. So let's go ahead and get into the spread real quick. Um... So it looks like it was feminines who was, I mean, other females who was jealous of the feminine, okay, and was trying to like mess up this connection between this feminine and his masculine. Okay, so we have destined for greatness in reverse, jealous boyfriend, and we have met at the hospital. So somebody is definitely jealous here, okay, you have a jealous boyfriend, somebody doesn't want somebody to look at their phone or something like that here. I kind of feel like this is definitely not a connection that's going to go anywhere, okay, um, in a situation, um, these people could have met at the hospital. They could work in the hospital or something like that here. Um, but I was getting somebody could work at the hospital um, or work in the healthcare field um, because we have met at the hospital. So somebody is definitely jealous, you know, trying to see who somebody was ch chatting with, talking to. Like they is really blowing the fuck up over this shit here. Um, I kind of feel like the situation isn't going to go anywhere, you know, based off of the fact that somebody gets in this, in this type of situation or cycle, they really need to leave this connection here. Okay. Um, so somebody needs to leave, walk away from this connection here and put their foot down. Okay. With this queen of swords, um, energy and this eight of cups. I kind of feel like with somebody just don't know how to get away from it. Okay. Or how to leave. They haven't figured out a way to like move away from the situation or this connection. And they are trying to like make this decision or trying to figure out how you know they're going to get out of the situation here and i kind of feel like um they may want to offer some type of love here or something to this feminine here but they may feel like this feminine won't accept their offers okay um because i kind of feel like whatever this feminine whatever offers or whatever they try to offer this feminine or whatever the case may be i kind of feel like they just bored or tired or it's just like they over it or whatever so yeah um I kind of feel like it is holding out, waiting for, you know, the offer from the Divine Feminine here. Because, like I said, they could have been getting offers from, like, the Feminine's um, best friends and, you know, friends and people who don't want to see the masculine and his feminine together. They was throwing themselves at them. And I kind of feel like this masculine could have, you know, got tired of, like, entertaining that. You know, they could have been entertaining it for a little while. But it looked like they could have had been getting tired of like entertaining it and they just basically like brushed it off or blew it off or whatever. Now they're waiting for, you know, this will of fortune to come in. So they're waiting for like the big shebang to come in. And this is the love offer from Divine Feminine here. Okay. Um, so yeah, they definitely want some type of um, union here with this feminine here with this Ace of Cups. Okay. Coming up with the Empress over top. So Ace of, so we have the Ace of Cups, Empress, and the, the um, Four of Wands. So they want a union here with this divine feminine here, but I kind of feel like, you know, um, somebody is like stressed out and worried a lot and they need to like stop worrying and stressing, okay, about 
you know, this love offer or, you know, whether or not somebody loves them or something like that because I kind of feel like they do love them. I kind of feel like this could be somebody else that's like getting inside their head or telling them that this person don't love them or that they don't want them or they don't want anything to do with them or whatever the case may be. These people is not working. They working against this feminine here. These are the people who is telling this feminine this, okay? They definitely working against this feminine um, and they don't want this feminine and this masculine to work things out or come together in any type of way. So, we have, um, they can definitely be holding on, okay, the, the masculine is definitely holding on, you know, to this, uh, holding on, okay, they holding a lot in, okay, um, I kind of like they're definitely holding a lot in, they're trying to figure out, you know, how they're going to move, how they, which way they're going to move, which direction they're going to move into you here, okay, and then, you know, and I kind of feel like, you know, they don't want to get into some type of conflict or emotions or arguments. I kind of feel like there's definitely some type of altercations or something going on with their family. Okay. Or within this family dynamic here. Okay. And this can make, this can have like a lot of effect of whatever's going on with this family dynamic. Okay. And this, whatever this is, this can have a lot to do with how this masculine makes decisions or Something like that. Hey, I'm getting somebody is sick too, like an elder, like the grandma, or something like that. Somebody here is sick. Um, yeah, somebody is sick. Um, but um, that just threw me off guard because I was looking at this card and it just threw me right off. Okay. Um, so. There's a lot of conflict here, okay? There's, there's something going on with the family where this family is like they make decisions or they have like a lot of say-so here or they pass a lot of judgment with what's going on with the, whatever this connection. This could be the reason why there's a lot of arguments and conflict here, here dealing with um, this masculine and this feminine here, okay? And I kind of feel like this is what changed the cycle. So this is what needs to end. So I kind of feel like somebody is like allowing like relatives or somebody else to like make judgment calls or make like final calls when it comes to their connection here it could be an Aquarius Scorpio Taurus or um Leo family members or your person or whoever um so yeah I kind of feel like they this is what's going on so somebody is trying to get somebody to cut this person off who they love here okay um yeah they're trying to get them to cut the situation off um, so this is other people that's influencing this is, this decision could be a Scorpio Cancer Pisces. Okay. Um, so yeah, the zodiac signs that we see here pretty much is, you know, Aquarius, Gemini, Libra, Cancer, all the fixed signs. Okay. Scorpio, Taurus, Pisces, um, Scorpio, Taurus, Aquarius, Leo, Scorpio, Cancer, Pisces, Pisces for sure, Libra. A lot of water sign and a lot of air. So the advice is right now is that there's a lot of snakes in your surroundings here with the snake card. Okay, it could be a fire sign, an, air, um, an Aries Leo or Sag, or this is pertaining to a fire sign. But yeah, there's a lot of snakes here that's trying to cause deception, okay, within your love connection, okay, or within your love life here, within this new union. And we have this book here closed, so you need to keep... You know, this whatever this is that you're trying to do with this commitment here, you need to keep this shit closed, closed off, close to yourself. This could be what was going on here with this masculine. So this masculine could be doing this, or this could be what this feminine is doing. Somebody is definitely holding something close to their chest, moving forward, you know, when they're making their moves, you know, into the direction here. Um, and I kind of feel like, you know, this is causing some type of emotional, like, conflict here because somebody don't know what somebody's moves is, but... Keep your moves to yourself. We have this book here. Keep everything confidential and closed here when it comes to this relationship because there's a lot of snakes here. Like, you can't trust anybody. You think that you can talk to people or, you know, get advice or bounce ideas back off of them. No, these bitches is haters. Like, it's sad that this is the world that we live in, but motherfuckers is haters. Like, they don't like to uplift you. They don't like to do anything. They just hate all fucking day. Like, this is what they do. They hate, hate, hate because they can't have it or because they don't have it. You know, they want what you have. They see that you have something better. These are people who are unhappy with their own fucking lives. Like, they don't love their selves. They don't love their lives. You know, they, they're not satisfied with what they have. They're not getting no blessings because they don't even, you know, they're not even... <laughs> 
focus on what they have or worrying, worrying about any blessings because they worrying about what the fuck you got. These are haters and you thinking that these people are your friends or that you can chit chat with them and all that. No, these bitches, you can't fuck with them. They the op, son. <laughs> Don't try and tell you. So we got within the next few within the next few months, things should be, you know, taking place. The opportunity should definitely arise between some type of opportunity should just definitely be coming about within the next two months. Okay, with, with within the next few months. All right. Um, and then we have God sends you flowers every spring and a sunrise every morning. Okay, so yeah, God loves you. Okay, you get. Flowers every spring and a sunrise every morning. You get woken up every morning. That's a blessing. Okay. That's a whole blessing. Like you, you get your blessings. You understanding your blessings. You seeing your blessings. And these people was watching your blessings and they trying to figure out why they ain't getting all that. Like instead of them worrying about why they ain't getting all that, they need to be doing the work and doing the shit that they need to do so they can get all that. You see what I'm saying? These motherfuckers stupid. So we got, uh, other than the signs that I called out already is Pisces, Moon, Capricorn, Sun, Cancer rising and a Virgo. Okay. So these was the reading, y'all. Hopefully you got something from it. Go ahead and like the video, subscribe to the channel, drop your comments, and I'll see you in the next one.